Hey guys, welcome back to Cube, the series where we tweak vanilla Minecraft with command blocks. Today I've made growth potions, and before we see what they do exactly, let's brew them. First up, we'll need an aqua potion like most other potions. Do this by putting another wart in a water bottle in the brewing stand. After that, take your aqua potion out and you'll need two more ingredients, rabbit hide and bone meal. Throw all three of these ingredients onto the brewing stand, and we'll brew a splash potion of instant growth. Now that we got our potion brewed, let's see its effects. First of all, any baby animal in the game will be instantly grown when the potion is thrown at it. Notice this has a certain area of effect because if we throw it to the side of the mobs, it only affects the ones in a 3 or 4 block radius. This works with all baby mobs in vanilla Minecraft. Using the same potion, you can also instantly grow the three main crops, wheat, potatoes, and carrots. Every plant in the potion's area of effect will get grown instantly, regardless of age. For example, a stage 1 wheat will grow to its full maturity alongside its stage 5 neighbor. To try this out for yourself, there's a pre-made world, but the even better way to do it is put it in a world that you've already worked on. Using MC Edit, you can import the schematic and this box will be placed in your world. Automatically, it'll install itself and turn itself on. Right-click the sign to toggle all functions of the machine on or off. To test when the potion splashes, we're constantly teleporting an armor stand to its location. When the armor stand hits the ground, we know when to apply the effects and particles. Using this method, it doesn't matter how far up you throw the potion from. To convert any baby animal into its adult form, we only need one command. By modifying its entity data to a higher age, the mob will turn into its grown-up form. Unfortunately, for other mobs like baby zombies, the age tag doesn't apply to them. They go by a tag called isBaby, and when it's set to 1, they're a baby. When we try to set it back to 0, which should turn them into adult, it doesn't work. So sadly, the growth potion doesn't work on baby zombies or baby zombie pigmen. When the growth potion is thrown at the crops, a fill command is being executed at it within a 2 block radius. In this example, we're placing any type of potato with its full grown variant, shown by the damage value of 7. Check the video description for both the pre-made world and the schematic file. Downloads are also available on my website where you can find all the downloads to the cubes. If you've never downloaded a cube creation before, and don't exactly know how, make sure to leave your questions in the comment section and I'll be sure to get to them. As always, if you really loved it, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time everybody!